All right, here we go. B and J's custom. Just giving y'all a quick shot of this car right here. This is a '87, '87 Cutlass. Um, I got this car here from a gentleman out in Oklahoma. Uh, what I'm gonna be doing with this car here is uh, he had already had the engine installed. This is a 60 with a um, 4L80E. And um, just giving y'all a quick shot of this, showing you what I got going on with this one here. You can see I got my tools out. Uh, hopefully you can hear me. I got a uh, compressor running. But uh, what I had to do was I took a two inch drill saw right here. I mean a drill, I guess you call it a hole saw. And I took it and I drilled out this hole right there. I drilled this hole out in the firewall. This customer right here, he wants his harness ran on the inside. And you know, of course, the harnesses, they come with a um, the harnesses, they come with a, a two-inch boot right here to seal it up on the inside. So this is the harness I'm going to be putting in. I'm going to be feeding this harness from the inside and it's going to be coming out that hole and going straight out to the engine uh, I'm also going to be putting a uh, fuel tank in this car he already got his fuel tank set up uh, I'm going to be doing that he got fuel lines I'm going to be putting fuel lines on it I'm going to be trying to get this uh, radiator fan to work uh, I'm also going to be looking for a set of headers on this car um, just to kind of give you a little update on what else I got going on. I got this uh this Regal right here. I'm not sure what year this Regal is. But this Regal has a 5.3 with a cam in it. Uh, I'm also going to be pulling this Regal back down. You can see right here these belong to another customer. I got the... Uh, uh, the cutout exhaust right here. I just cut them off with my uh, reciprocating saw. But uh, this car right here, it's got a 5.3 in it. Um, this one, I didn't install neither, but I'm gonna be pulling the heads off of this one, putting 243 heads on that 5.3, because of course it came with um, 862s or 706s. I'm gonna be pulling the cam out. We're gonna be going with a bigger cam. Um, uh, basically, I'm going to be doing um, a timing chain, uh, oil pump. Uh, pretty much, we're going to be doing an upgrade, and we're going to be taking the, um, the um, this one had a reworked harness on it that did not, not have fuses or relays, so we're going to be changing that out to a reworked, I mean, to a, a brand new harness, just like the one I just showed you in this car right here. I got that one. I still got the uh, uh, the sharp bed swap going on. Um, I have I should be able to. I should have it in. Uh, in this weekend, if the weather hold up, you know this been raining a lot here in Dallas. I uh, also have. I got a Tudo Caprice here. That's going to be getting a 6.0 with an upgraded 60E in it. Let's keep going. Uh, my very next project, I know a couple people asked me about it. Go to Regal again. A couple people asked me about it. It's going to be right here. It's 71 Chevelle convertible a couple people had asked me about it what happened to this swap here well we was waiting on the vintage air AC to come in and then we was gonna roll through with it this car here gonna get a 6.2 um, not sure what transmission yet but uh, it's gonna be getting a 6.2 the uh, owner came picked it up and he got a um, rhino line sprayed underneath of everything um, this car gonna get a 6.2 two. 
not sure what transmission i might do an upgrade at 700 r4 i'm not 100 percent sure yet but uh this one is coming uh next this is the next one i'm gonna start on and this one gonna be a good one but uh yeah i'm just pretty much giving y'all a quick update on what i got going on um but right now as of right now i'm working on this cutlass i'm gonna be getting this one probably wrapped up uh pretty soon today is the um i think today is the 29th april but like i always say uh stay tuned uh look out for some more videos coming for all those cars i just showed you i got videos coming i got other cars and videos coming uh, like I say, the videos are always delayed. I'll probably put this video out uh, probably a week, two weeks from now. But um, uh, like and subscribe. Uh, let's try to get to a thousand subscribers. Um, uh, I'll put my link, uh, my link for my phone number, my uh, email address, and in the screen, so you can give me a call for any questions, cares, concerns, anything. Uh, I try to help people out where I can, hoping somebody help me, but uh, that's it, it's being Jay's Custom, we out.